good morning. It's uh, Lawrence Finney of Finney's Flies here. What we're going to be tying uh, today is a pattern that I uh, came up with a few weeks ago for likes of Loch Sheelan. It's uh, the loop sedge. So using a size 10 hook, black thread, and we're just going to set the thread onto the hook. Just to there. Next thing we're going to be putting on is for the loop. So we get two this is Pickwick Olive. Two CDC feathers set together. Catch them on the hook. Tie it, bed that in. Trim off them these stalks. The body, my old favourite here, is the pseudo hackle. So this is trimmed to about one and a half millimetres. So we're going to catch that in, come back a couple of turns, come forward. Stop just where the stalks are. And I'm just going to wind that in, touching turns, coming up the hook. That's just creating that nice body effect. Once it's there, just secure all that pseudo heckle in, trim it off. And then what we do, just get the, the CDC, get him by the points, fold him over. Catch him in and just get them in so you've got a nice big loop. Trap that all in. And what you can do if you want, any of these wee fluffy bits, put down the bottom there, just trim those off if you want to. Basically it's just aesthetics. So once he's done there, the next thing we're going to do is get two more CDC fibres, put them together, set them on the top. Just want this coming back over the loop just about there. So get them in, pinch and loop, bed that in, trim off the waist. So any of the wee bits here, we can just trim them off like such. Once these got on there, we're going to put the hackle on. And this is just a Pickwick Olive Whiting's uh, Dry Fly Saddle. So we catch that in. Come back a wee bit more and come forward and we're just going to wind that in tight against the CDC just working the bow up to the eye nice bushy hack up catch him in and secure that turn the stalk off down to the bottom finish it off there two black claret cock pheasant fibres just going to set it on the top, pinch, loop, bring him over, pull him to the desired out, that's about the right size, secure that in, just trim them off, just bring them fibers forward, just catch them in, then we're just going to whip finish. Any fibres, you can trim them back, just check around. There we go, happy enough with that there. We don't want to take too much of this CDC off, so we want to leave some to trail. So we've just trimmed that how I would like it. So once he's done, just going to put the varnish on, two coats, more than enough. And with that there, with the two loops and the two wing fibres there, you're going to flow good. Plus you can pull them through the, the water as a dry fly. So there we go. That's uh, my loop sedge. So as you say, own island, happy wrappings.